Okay, so in this question, we're not given what the probability of getting, it says, a 1 on this spinner is. We've got to calculate it. So it says it's apparently fair. Now, by fair, it means that each section of the spinner is equally spaced and there's no weights or secret blue tack that stop the spinner on a specific number. Now, if there's 11 outcomes, it means the probability of getting a 1 is... 1 over 11. Now if we spin it 60 times to get the expected amount of 1's we do the amount of times we spin it which is 60 and times it by the probability which is 1 over 11. So I can do that on my calculator I'll do 60 times 1 over 11 or what I could do is 60 divided by 11 it gives you the same answer and it gives me the answer of 5.5 recurring okay so it says find the expected amount now what I would do here is round that down to five now we could I think most exams would allow you to round this if it's 5.6 or something round it up to six but we haven't actually reached six yet so I would always round down for this type of question in the exam, they normally give you a range of numbers, so you're normally fine if you round up or round down. Um, but make sure that it's a whole number, because you can't get 5.45 ones. Uh, you can only get 5 or 6. This one we would round down anyway, because it's 5.4, so it would round down to 5.